Um, Day, I'd like to start with a question for you. In this discussion about caregiving, so often the people who receive the care are not incorporated. And there's a mantra in the disability world, nothing about us without us. Could you talk about the importance of incorporating the, the recipients of care? Sure. Uh, actually, I think you can get that answer from, from almost any person with a disability and actually from any marginalized community. If you think about the way stories are told, um, the perspectives that any issues are told from, they're framed outside the community. And so what happens is uh, what is deemed best for a community, ways to resolve problems, improve living conditions, standards, anything, then it's done by, based on assumptions. Um, and I think nowhere have we seen more of that than within the disability community that's been done unto that community because the idea is there's this historical cultural perspective um, of uh, people with disabilities as, as needing care, as in um, uh, questions about capacity, regardless of what that disability is. Therefore, uh, it's been a battle in many ways to say, you know, uh, we can speak for ourselves. We can tell you what we need. You just need to listen and be willing to follow through on that. So, so I think part of it is that authentic representation, and that is where the nothing about us without us is such a key element. And it's not just in disability issues. We, sh we people with disabilities can speak and should be allowed to speak on issues related to education, healthcare, civil rights, technology. Why? Because disability is everywhere.